It's a touchdown. Manziel, that ball looks like it was snapped before he was ready. It hits him and bounces around. He's able to pick it up. I thought he was going to throw it away. And on the pump pick, the ball's not loose. And Mikel Roby comes away with the six points for Buffalo. Simon Manziel gives his leg like he wants the snap, but then he, he looks over to his left at the last second, right when the ball comes in. He's not ready to catch it. It bounces off, and Kyle Williams is able to make contact there. As I thought he was just trying to. I thought he was just trying to throw it away, but he was bringing it back in. And the question would be, was his arm going forward? He had stopped his motion when Kyle Williams hit him. He goes back to that Tom Brady tuck rule from years ago. Was there it was cool <laughs> brought it back down and that was right into the meat hooks of kyle williams and mikhail roby comes comes up with the football in the end zone and they're taking a look at it The frustrating thing of your Cleveland when you look at how this game has unfolded is that defensively they play, they played a pretty good game. You think about it, you know the uh, the Bills had less than 300 yards of offense, but two defensive touchdowns or what could potentially be a second defensive touchdown. They've gotten some turnovers. They've made the right calls offensively here in the, the second half. He stops his passing motion, and then Kyle Williams just knocks the ball away from him. It appears he has, Pierce Roby has possession of the ball before he slides out of bounds. That could be what they're taking so long looking at as well. Mike Carey is our officiating expert in New York. Hello, Mike. Hey, Greg, how are you? I'm fine. What'd you think? Two parts of this review. The rule is the tuck rule. So Manziel brings the ball back to his body. The ball comes out. Clear fumble. When the ball is recovered in the end zone by Buffalo, you see a clear recovery. Rolls over. No movement of the ball. Could be a touchdown. Gee, everything is just so crystal clear to Mike Carey. It's amazing. Definitive as could be. Thank you, Mike. Here comes Jerome Boulder. After reviewing the play. The quarterback's hand was going forward when he was hit. So it's an incomplete pass. It's going to be two good hard, fourth down on the 18 yard line. Please just set the game clock for two minutes, 54 seconds. Two fifty-four on the game clock. Mike, that didn't, that didn't sound like what you said, did it? It didn't look like what I saw either. <laughs> what I saw was him bringing the ball back towards his body. And once it starts coming back towards his body, it ceases to be a pass. It comes loose, that's a fumble. Yeah, I agree with you, Mike. I think that Menzel clearly decided not to throw that football and brought it back to his body. And I agree with you guys also. I think, I think it was, it, it's pretty obvious that he was trying to bring that ball back into his body, not throw it. Jerome Boger didn't see it that way, called it incomplete. 